to Relax My Dog. Today I'm going to be sharing with you how to make this super, super quick little dog toy. Like I say, it's quick, it's cheap and it is extremely easy to make. So firstly, what you will need is just an old t-shirt and just a pair of scissors. It really is that easy. So let's get started. So firstly what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut along the side of the t-shirt just along the seam. As you can see I'm just using regular kitchen scissors so it might be a little bit easier if you have fabric scissors because this took quite a long time for me to cut. Just cut along one edge so you have a long continuous piece of material and you have sort of a split in your t-shirt as you can see here. Then all I need to do is just cut a little bit where my shoulder will go. I'm just going to cut along there. This will then leave an extremely long piece of material for you to then use to make your DIY dog toy. Then I'm just going to split my t-shirt into three pieces. These don't have to be equal, don't worry, it's just for your dog. I'm sure he won't mind it being a little bit uneven. Or at least Martha didn't anyway. This will leave one long piece of material and then all you have to do is do the two until you have three similar sized balls. Then what I do next is I grab each end and tie it in a very tight knot. You don't want this to come loose so make sure it is as tight as possible as you can get it. That will leave you with one tight knot and then three strands off it looking like this. Then I begin twisting the material. This makes it a little bit sturdy for your dog to use and it makes it last a little bit longer and less flimsy for your dog. Just repeat this on the others until your dog toy looks a little bit like this. Then all you need to do is just start braiding them together. If you don't know how to braid, you can actually search a tutorial on YouTube. It's really, really simple. You just weave them in and out of each other. But like I say, it does take a rather long time. But once you get used to it, you can do it super, super fast. I'll actually show you a little time lapse of me doing this now. Then once you've finished, your dog toy should look a little bit like this. Then you just need to twist the other end and tie it in a tight knot again. Then because I'm quite a neat freak, I like it to look not very messy, so I decide to cut off the messy ends, as you can see here, but you don't have to do this. So your dog toy should look a little bit like this. As you can see, it's basically just a long braid, but because I like it to look a bit more funky, I decided to add more knots to it. So I added a knot in the middle. Let's see what Milo thinks of his toy. What's this? Get it, get it, get it. Be here. Thank you. Ready, get it, get it, get it, get it. Where's your toy? Get it. Thank you. Here you go. As you can see, Milo absolutely loves his new dog toy. Don't forget to give us a like if you enjoyed it and leave a comment down below letting us know what you think. Also, don't forget to create your own dog toy and tag us on Instagram at relaxmydog. And also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And we will see you next time. Bye. Come here.